best known for his roles in Breaking Bad and Under the Dome, actor Dean Norris has certainly been a busy guy. And he's got a new project coming out for the History Channel, and he's joining me now to tell us a lot more about it. Good morning, Dean. How are you? Good morning. How you doing? I'm doing great. Now, to say you were a busy guy is probably the biggest understatement of the year. You're working on this new show, Sons of Liberty. Tell me about it. Yeah, it's a it's a real kind of you know raucous body look at our, our founding fathers and the and the start of our country. Um, it's uh, it's it's really it's not your high school history version of the American Revolution. It's uh, it's a real kind of fun uh, look at the at these crazy guys who started our country. Now, Dean, when I see these historical dramas taking place, I wonder how much liberty there was with the drama. I mean, are we are we getting a pretty accurate story? I hope it's a shapely one. Yeah, we are. I think what you're going to see is maybe some stuff you didn't you didn't uh, read about in high school. You know, uh, that doesn't mean it's not accurate. Maybe it's more accurate. Uh, certainly in Ben Franklin's case, you kind of see a, a more fun-loving guy. He's not this stodgy old old inventor guy that you might have thought of. He was a guy that kind of enjoyed to party. He he liked the ladies and uh, he liked his drink, but. Uh, he was also uh, the genius that we all know. I love it. And so you you play Benjamin Franklin. What did you have to do to prepare to get ready for the role? You know, I, I obviously uh, you had to put a little hair on my head, uh, his crazy wig, um, and uh, got into his costume, got into his wardrobe, and and I, I just because I'm that kind of guy, I did a lot of research in, into into what he was really like. But a lot of the stuff was most of the stuff was actually right there on the page exactly. in the scripts, and it was a, it was a real hoot to read the. The, the three Legend. nights and uh, uh, had a lot of fun playing them. I've now, one of the things I think so interesting when we're doing a drama like this that has so much to do with our freedoms, it, it's kind of relevant to what's going on today, right? Well, I think it is. I mean, you know, we always learn about today when we look at the past and, and to kind of see what these guys did. The, the, the really, you know, the, the kind of the gonads it took, if you will, for these guys, these 20-year-old guys to decide that they were going to become their own country, that they wanted to not be ruled by a king, that they wanted to really rule and run their own country. It's an amazing, amazing, you know, revolutionary, truly revolutionary idea. And they were they were rebels in the true sense of the word. So to kind of see where we, we came from is always a, an interesting thing to do. Yeah, and people say history is boring. But speaking of where we came from, Breaking Bad, um, what was it like yeah. going from a show like that to doing this really wonderful historical project? Well, it was it was fantastic. You know, the uh, you know obviously Breaking Bad was such a special show, and we'll always miss it. But it's uh, afforded me the opportunity now to get to to pick and choose some some fun roles, uh, and uh, this came along, and uh, it couldn't be you know obviously more different than Hank. So <laughs> it was uh, it was a real it was a real fun thing to do. I love it. What do you think it was about Breaking Bad that that really hit home with everyone that connected? You know, I think it was uh, the ev kind of the everyman story of this guy who really just wanted to, uh, you know, take care of his family and started going down this bad road and just had kept going and going and going. And uh, I think we all kind of, you know, wish we could be a little bit like Walter White sometimes, you know. I love it. And of course, Breaking Bad, Under the Dome, and now Sons of Liberty. Um, what do you have going on next after this? Well, I've got a couple of movies that I did. I'm doing a movie right now with uh, a young lady named Julia Roberts and Nicole Oh, yeah, Kidman. I've heard of her. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, we're filming that now, uh, and that'll be out sometime, uh, sometime in the fall. Well, awesome. This looks great. I'm going to check it out. Good. Thank you. Awesome. Thanks for joining us this morning. All Absolutely. right, you can catch Sons of Liberty on the History Channel when it premieres this Sunday at 8 o'clock Central Time. Check your local listings for channel information.